Brad and Get Logic for providing me the information that helps me do this um this this uh, crown duplication. So basically, we start off with the usual. We're gonna start off with one table. Oh, let's let's uh, get into the right mode first. All right, we're gonna be in uh, this third person panel. We're gonna start off with one table, one low table, two items that you can duplicate. I'm going to use two boxes, and then um, your shark as well as two items that cannot be duplicated you can use two crowns or if um you want to use two fish i find it easier because it's easier to catch especially when you're starting out and you don't have any crowns but okay so we're going to start off with um this layout having the two two duplicated items on top you're going to grab your your um one by one table you're going to grab your shark and just like you're duping sharks you're going to pick up the whole table and bring it right to the center right Right there should be good. You're going to do that to both sides, and this should duplicate both the um, both sides of your table. So you're going to take that away, you're going to leave, and we're going to go upstairs and come back. Now, if both of those boxes are underneath the table, that means your process is ready, and you can start duping. If not, you can either um, redo the whole process, or go up and down the stairs a couple of times until both items are under the table. Okay, so we have them both under the table, so we're basically gonna hover over it and we're gonna put it in our inventory using Y. Now, without moving the table, we're gonna start in the top left corner, we're gonna grab the item that we're duplicating and put it in, in the table. Now, you can have one in the center, but I prefer to have two. I don't wanna waste my time, so we're gonna try to keep Getting to that corner until both of them go under the table. All right, that didn't work. Get it in here, under the table. All right. Now I'm going to try one more time. If it doesn't work, I'm just going to redo this whole thing again. All right, yeah, it didn't work. So we're going to start over. I'm going to grab our table. Uh, we need the other items. What else? Lotatable, two boxes, a shark, and two fish. All right. And I'm doing this live, guys, so mistakes may happen, but overall, you'll see the end result. Hopefully. Right, we're gonna do the same process again. All right, move it over and put it in there. Put that away. We're gonna go up, come back down. Hey, Cookie, how are you doing today? Thank you for stopping by. All right, so once again, they're under the table. Let's see if it actually works. I'm going to take them away. I'm going to start in the, the top left corner. And we're going to grab our items. One is under the table. And that one doesn't want to go under the table. Oh, nice. What uh, what fish are you catching, Cookie? Okay. This is not working. We're going to do the whole thing again. Hey, Phantom, how you doing? Yeah, so I basically found a trick that allows you to um, get a ton of crowns. I'm basically showing everybody the process that I use to, to get it done. All 
I just got to get this truck up there. All right, now let's try it over here. Uh, well, if you keep watching Phantom, you might see it work. I'm doing this live, and uh, it might not work, but we will see. All right, I'm gonna leave the room, and so so far, like the glitch has worked on one side, but I don't want to just do it on one side. I want it on both sides. Because the end result, it's much faster when you can get it done on both sides. All right, so we're going to take those over and let's see if this time they, uh, they go under the table. All right, we want it in the corners. Okay, so now we're ready to go. So now we have the crowns under the table. We don't want to take those away. We're going to keep those. We're going to bring it to the top corner, top left corner. Now we're going to grab the two crowns that were there. They should still be there, right? Both of them right there. We're going to pick one up. We're going to put it on top of the table. Okay. Now, basically, we're going to rinse and repeat, and we're going to go through this entire floor and fill it with crowns. So we're going to pick up the whole table, bring it over, and... Oh, I just messed up. Okay. So, let's uh, grab another crown, bring another there. Perfect. So I'm going to pick it up. And we're going to put it right on top. Now we're going to grab the whole thing, bring it over, and pick them up, bring it over. One thing I notice about this dupe is if you mess up, it's very easy to, um, to fix your mistakes. So we're going to bring them down, go halfway down that square, and basically fill up that entire square with crowns. Now we're going to go over, and we're basically going to continue this process until our entire map is filled. Now, um, now the only thing you're not, the only area you're not gonna have crowns is either the bottom left or bottom right hand corner. But as you can see, like once we get the initial table set up, like this is. Oh wait, let's put that back. Kind of want everything nice and even. We're just gonna, you know, rinse and repeat. Put everything right there. Grab the whole table, bring it over, and we're just gonna keep going. All right. So we lost one there, but it's okay. All in all, if like there's one or two crowns that are missing, I'm not too upset about. All right, where did the other one go? There we go. Pick that up. Bring it down and we're gonna keep going. And also like, I like the fact that I'm doing this live. So you guys are gonna see my mistakes you're going to see how I do this in action and overall how, how long the process actually takes. I've seen, I've seen people do this um, in like um, 15 minute videos and such. And I mean, yeah, it works, but overall, I usually get through an entire, an entire set in about, um, what, two, three minutes. So. So as, as you can see, like I just messed up there, but yet I'm still able to um, to uh, pick up the crowns. All right, a little glitchy there. All right, we're back. Fix up the squares and we'll go through the whole thing. All right, doesn't want to go through there. I'm missing some crowns here. Where did that go? I want that one that's in that corner, but there we go. Okay. Um, I've actually never tried it with a gold rose cookie. Um, I've never been able to grow, grow a gold rose. I do have a blue rose, uh, so I, I might try that maybe tomorrow. But uh, I actually just wanted to make this video real quick for um, a couple of friends on Discord that uh, had had a few questions. Um, so, Phantom, in order to get the crown, it comes up in the shop. It costs, I think, 1.2 million, though. Um, but once you get one crown, you know, 
you can uh, slowly work your way up to having a ton of these things. And then once you do, you a millionaire, sir. Okay, so we're, we're nearing the end of this process right here. We're just going to do that last square in the bottom right. Bring it over. And we're going to take this whole thing and we're going to put it away. Now, the final step is we're going to take tables and we're going to fill up our entire platform with tables. Okay. And then we're going to exit this and we're going to leave. <laughs> no worries, Phantom. You could definitely get up there. So, um, HHCCY, I actually did watch that video of, um, of getting the, uh, of doing the bug, bug method, but I'm not sure how many times you can go back and forth with it. So I decided like not to do that one because the, um, the, the timing it takes for the actual placement seemed like a very long time. And I just didn't want to go through that whole process to find out that I would have to, after getting that whole row done. I'd have to do it all over again. But yeah, that's basically it. Unlimited. Whoa. Oh, I might need to do that method then. All right. I mean, right now I'm at about 700. But uh, that, I mean, if it's unlimited, that, that might be a game changer. I might have to take my time with it. But um, that's basically it. Then uh, you take the whole the whole inventory and you just put it in your pocket. And that's that's the way I do it. Oh yeah, HC, thank you for that. Um, definitely gonna try that out. I'm gonna do a couple of rounds off camera and see how it works out for me. See if it's worth uh, putting in that effort. I appreciate it. But um, to everyone to watching this video, I appreciate the views. Thanks so much, I, um, it's been great. If you enjoyed this and wanna see more or have any ideas that you'd wanna see me do, just you know, shoot me a message. I'm always open to um, new ideas. Cookie, if you want, I can always send you the table. Just uh, let me know and I'll send you the stuff. You know, it's no big deal. But all right, everybody, I'm going to head out because it's extremely late at, uh, at this time for me. So I'm going to head to bed. Take it easy, everybody.